Welcome back to the Ichi Mahjong Guide. In today's video, we'll be talking about four rare yaku. They, they don't really have much to do with the shape of the hand so much as the tile on which you win. And they're pretty easy to remember because they're so uh, uncommon. Especially if you watch Saki, I'm sure you'll be able to remember all of them, no problem. And of course, the first one we're going to talk about is Vinshan Kaihou. Uh, in English, it's known as uh, winning from the dead wall draw. So I'm sure you remember that the only way to draw a tile from the dead wall is to declare a con. So for instance, let's say we've got this closed hand and we draw another nine mon. So since we're in Tenpai, why not just declare con? Set that off to the side, flip our door indicator, and draw our tile from the dead wall. Ah, it's the one so on which we were waiting. Uh, in this case, not only do we get the Yaku for Men's and Sumo because our hand was closed and we won by Tsumo, we also get the Yaku for Vinshan Kaiho for winning our hand from the Vinshan tile or dead wall draw. This Yaku, like all the rest of the Yaku in this video, can be used to give Yaku to a hand with no other Yaku. So for instance, if you just started calling on tiles and you're hoping for a, a Chanta or something, but you're not quite there yet, you're in Tenpai but you don't have any Yaku right now, and you just happen to draw something with which you can make a con, you might as well try it, right? So you declare con, flip the door indicator, draw your tile, and there you go. You, you can win this hand with just the Yaku, the Inshan Kaiho. The next Yaku is Chan Kan. Uh, this was also featured kind of prominently in Saki, known in English as robbing a quad or robbing a con. Uh, Chankan is a very, very specific Yaku. Uh, it can only be claimed uh, when an opponent declares a Shomin Khan, meaning that they have a pawn, like so, and they upgrade it to a Khan. So in this case, let's say uh, the person across from you declares Khan on the one so, and they uh, add it to their pawn, hoping to make a Khan. In this case, because the one so is one of the tiles on which we can win. When they make that Shomin Khan, you can declare Dom. This Yaku can be used to win a hand with no other Yaku. It is much, much more rare than Dinshan Kaiho because it's much more specific, but it is something to keep in mind. The last two Yaku uh, that we're going to cover are related, and they both have to do with the last tile in the live wall. So the first of these two Yaku is Hai Te Dao Yue. Normally it's just known as Haite. This is winning by Tsumo on the last tile in the wall. So for instance, let's say you've got this hand. Uh, it could be a Chanta if you win on the one so, uh, but if you draw the four so, you're gonna be kinda out of luck. Uh, but you do get the Haite, or the last tile in the live wall. And you draw, and it's a four so. Normally, since this hand has no Yaku, you would not be able to win with the four so. However, because it is the last tile on the wall, you can gain the Yaku uh, for Haite and declare Tsumo with just Haite Tsumo only. It is just a one on hand, but it's better than nothing. It means that even if you call and call and have a no Yaku hand at the end of the game, uh, you can still win on that last tile. The counterpart to Haite is Hote, uh, the full name being Hote Dao Yui. This is just uh, winning by Don on the last tile. So let's say one of your opponents draws the last tile. That tile that they drew is the Haite, but the tile they deal from their hand, the tile they discard is the Hote. So if they discard, for instance, the Forso, on which we are waiting, we can declare Don for just Hote, because that is the last tile, giving it Yaku. So because of these two Yaku, Haite and Hote, uh, even if you open up your hand and end up with a, a no Yaku Tenpai at the end of the game, you can win on the last tile, regardless of whether you draw it or it's the last tile that's discarded. Uh, one special case I'd like to note, if there is one tile left in the live wall and someone declares a con, so let's say one of your opponents, doesn't matter who, declares a con, open and close, doesn't matter. They draw a tile from the dead wall, the Vinchan tile. The, that last tile from the live wall gets added to the dead wall to keep it at 14 tiles. The tile they discard from their hand right now is considered the Hote. Even though the Vinchan tile is not considered the Haite, 
uh, because it wasn't the last tile from the live wall. The tile that they are going to discard is considered the hote because it is the last tile that will be discarded. So to review, uh, in this video we covered four rare one han yaku, vinchan uh, kaiho, chankan, haite, and hote, all of which are based entirely on the tile on which you win, not the composition of your hand or anything like that, and therefore can be used to give yaku to a hand with no other yaku. Don't expect to be calling everything, getting down to the last tile of the, the live wall and winning by Haite or Hote every game. But if you just happen to be in a no Yaku Tenpai or you just happen to win on the last tile or after declaring a con, then you just get that extra bonus Yaku added to your hand. But these aren't things that you should be necessarily going for, for your Yaku. Just think of them as a, a nice bonus. And so as usual, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below and thank you for watching.